you guys. Just doing a periscope here. We're shooting late at night on the beach. And uh, I'm not in this particular shot, so I'm hanging out by the monitors. There's the monitor. We're shooting way down there on the beach. You can see the lights. And uh, that was the script supervisor taking notes. Watching. Filming late again. That's right, Lon. Sure am. It is cold. Well, it's not that cold. Everything's relative. It's a water. Rolling, rolling. And uh, yeah, it's gonna be. We're gonna be here late, actually. Um, how many days do we film? Do we film for like about a month. So about four weeks, almost four weeks of shooting. Yeah, you can see them doing some of those singing groups. be that quiet because they're shooting down at the beach where the waves are really loud so they'd never be able to hear me hey Johnny 12 style shouting out yes yeah, so if you guys think this is cool please take a moment and share just click on the number of viewers in the lower right hand corner I love all the hearts you guys it is a full moon yeah check it out check out that moon thank you Rabbit Morning Brandy thank you Hellsinger <clears throat> Mur is not here right now but I'm sure he'd love it. Thank you, Jay Del Vega. First time joining me live. Welcome, Andy. Thank you, Amara One. So here we are. Yeah. Thank you, Steve Kim and Amara One for sharing two ways. Guys are bringing some equipment to set. Thank you, Brandy and the three brothers. Actually, kind of a long scene. So, anyway, thank you, Carolyn, for sharing. We are filming on the beach in Los Angeles. Thank you, Elegant Projects. I appreciate that. So it's pretty late. I think it's like, it must be close to one in the morning, actually. Thank you, Friends for Jesus. Well, I love being on set, Troy, so I'm grateful, even when they're long hours. Thank you, Deke Rivers and Deke Papa Dog. Well, not all shoots are in the middle of the night, and these are, but I've been doing a lot of them lately for some reason. Thank you, Tiffany Brown. Five minutes to one a.m. Yes, exactly. So my sleep schedule is crazy, Mimi. It sure is. Thank you, Mark. Well, you know what? I don't drink coffee, Mark. Um, I mean, Andrew. Thank you, Sakin Sixteen. I don't speak. Is that Russian? Well, good morning. Hello, Gregor the boss. Hey, Australia. So it must be some civilized time in Australia right now, I imagine. You guys can hear me when I'm talking at this level, right? Thank you, Fubar. I might have to do ADR on this, Steve. I'm not sure. Thank you, Ryan. Yes, 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 you can hear me. Oh, good, good, good. Thank you. Brandy, what are you doing up at four in the morning? <laughs> My pleasure, Andrew. That's the cool thing about Periscope, is you get to interact with people. How do I deal with being a mom and early wake up? Okay, well, I don't do it by myself, that's for sure. I have help, and uh, Draco's with his dad when I'm shooting right like this. You can't sleep, Brandy? 5.15, 6 p.m. in Australia, nice turkey, how very cool. My mom is probably sleeping right now at home. Thank you, Sally, Mama, Mama Sally. Thank you. Oregon, cool, France, bonjour. So yeah, this scene is still going on like a four page thing. Thank you, Sally, for sharing. I know, right? Oh, oh, hey, Julia. Julia, you like to stay up late, don't you? I've noticed that. You're a bit of a night owl. I used to be. How do you do it with kids, though? I don't understand that. You're welcome, Howard. So yeah, I really, I love like sharing this stuff with you guys, showing you sort of the behind the scenes. Thank you, Chad. Oh, for the baby who doesn't want to sleep, Julia. Okay, I get it. I remember those days. 
Thank you, Tiffany. Thanks, Juan. Thank you, Ms. Lee, M. Sly. I'm not going to tell you exactly which beach I am on just for security reasons, just in case there was somebody strange who's watching, because you never know. It's a weird uh, spammer. Keeps coming in and out. Oh, that's too bad. Cutting. That's a cut. Um, what state? I'm in California. Hang on, I'm trying to grab a. Yeah, creepers, right? Well, I find love under the Delta Christmas table. <laughs> I did a movie um, for Lifetime called Love at the Christmas Table. Is that what it's called? Really cute. That's a cut. Oh, you guys heard that. I was like, why are y'all saying LOL, that's a cut? Oh, because they just said that's a cut here. Yes. OMG, no hill. I used to be winning Cooper. It's absolutely right. Somebody's standing in front of my light right now that I thought was going to work. What did I say in French? I said bonjour. It just means hi. It is not warm, Julia. I'm wearing a big coat, which can't, and I'm wearing these big boots, which I'm not sure you can see in the office. Were you guys able to see the boots? These big boots that I got. Oh, that person moved out of my light. Cool. Sorry. Um, oh no, you're good. Oh, you're hey, stuck. I'm stuck. <laughs> I'm you're... stuck. There we go. Oh, there you go. Sorry. Uh, yes, yeah, so they gave me a big coat to wear and um, big boots. Why are movies made so late? Good question. The reason that my Hallmark movie was made so late, uh, the Christmas one, is because we were shooting in a mall, in a department store. We could only shoot in it when it was closed. So it was closed from like 8 p.m. until 8 a.m. That's when we were allowed to shoot. In this case, we're shooting a scene at night, but because scenes shoot, they take a long time to shoot, something that will take four minutes or five minutes on screen will take six to seven hours to shoot. So you need to shoot overnight in order to keep it looking at night the whole time. Ooh, very cool. So, I don't know how what the temperature is. It feels like it's in the low 60s. It's not that bad. But I still have a nice, cozy, warm jacket on. Just Because I'm a California girl, and I'm not used to cold weather. <laughs> yeah. The, I can't tell you too much about the film yet, except that at this point it's called Mommy, I Didn't Do It. And um, my, yeah, maybe it takes a while. So, it takes, typically, if you're going really fast, you can shoot about a minute of, um, of movie in about an hour. But that is going really fast. If you want to do a, if you have a bigger budget and you can really take your time, then it's two to three hours per minute. Because there's typically about a minute per page. Of course, that can always change, that's just an average. Oh shoot, you guys are going too fast, I missed a troll, that's all right. Your company, Axelrod, has been making a ton of Hallmark movies. It's very cool. Hallmark makes a lot of movies. This is not a Hallmark film. I'll tell you that much. It is very different from the Hallmark so films. Is that the last car? Yes. Uh, Thank you. Thanks, guys. What does SLM stand for? Yeah. I'm good. I got that one. Look. I am writing some math books, actually. From little for little kids. I don't know comma cause if anybody shoots actual film anymore. Hi, she's doing a periscope. Check this out. Do you mind? This is Jenna. She wears a light on her head, which is so awesome. <laughs> so that she can Sorry. do touch ups and so she can see. Yes, your cats. I am an actress working on a movie right now. Yes, I was on The Wonder Years. You're absolutely correct. Very quietly, guys. I might have been your crush in junior high, Will. Thank you, Autumn. Thanks, guys. So, we are shooting a movie here on the beach late at night, and we will be continuing to shoot for a while. And um, no, it was it was S L M, I think. Thank you. This is not Vancouver. This is Los Angeles. Yes. So we're shooting a movie, and right now she's about Jenda is um, this woman, name lovely woman who is amazing at makeup, and she's oh, going. Sorry. Right there. That's okay. So she's wearing a light on her head so that she can see, which is so awesome. <laughs> I can't see her at all. I oh, know, I'm sorry. You guys, your eyes. I'm all blown up. No, I, think we're, I think we're not rolling. But even if we are, we can we're talk so because they can't hear us. And we're competing with the ocean. I'm acting in this movie, Elegant Projects. I'm not producing it, I'm just acting in it. 
My favorite part about being an actress, that's a really good question. Mm -hmm. I love the camaraderie on set because we're all like coming together and having to make this movie happen. That's really fun. I also really just love the acting part. I love channeling the, the emotions of the character. <laughs> it's very fulfilling. Justin, we are shooting a movie called Mommy, I Didn't Do It. Now that is the current title. These titles change sometimes. But the movie is about, um, so my daughter is accused of murder and I have to defend her in court. The furthest I've traveled for a role, CJ, I think is possibly Romania. Well, which one's farther mm. away, Romania or Bulgaria? I've shot in both oh, places. Oh, kind of think they're neighbors. I think they are neighbors. I'm not sure which one's actually closer. Um, I'm gonna go with Bulgaria. Thank you, Dolly, for inviting followers. Okay, so, um, uh, shoot, maybe they'll tell us. Hmm? Maybe someone will know. Yeah, which one's closer to Los Angeles, farther away? Anyway, so I've shot in Romania and Bulgaria, both pretty far away. I shot in Romania last year, my Christmas movie from last year called Crown for Christmas. That one is very popular. A lot of people have been asking for a sequel. Thank you, name I can't say, FJEXP169156. Thank you, I am Thomas, uh, Thomas Anderson. Um, and then I shot a movie in Bulgaria. It was in 2004 with Chris Pratt. Okay. It was a movie called Path of Destruction for the Sci Fi Channel. That was pretty cool. Psycho comments, I know, some of them are just kind of psycho. Pratt, 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 that's right. He was a lot of fun to work with. Hide from the valley. The eyebrow game is strong. Thank you, Kamikaze. <laughs> but it's spelled like comma. Nice. Like a comma. Nice. Classy. Thanks, Will. <laughs> Do I ever forget my lines? Sometimes. Not too often. Well, it happens. Me. Especially if you're shooting a lot of stuff in a day. Thank you, Drew. I appreciate it. I'm very happy with my life. And it would be silly for me to complain and say, oh, I should be in bigger movies. Because honestly, I'm having an amazing time and everybody's so great. It is so important for us to be just grateful, grateful for what we have. Everybody, everybody could choose to think about what they don't have. Or they could choose to appreciate what they do have. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And we are making the film right now. They're actually shooting um, a, a part of a scene that I'm not in. And I'm just sitting behind the monitors. So that's Paige Searcy. She plays my daughter. And you can see back there behind, they're actually doing the shooting. They're like down there on the beach. And um, that's what we're doing. I'm trying to think about Ben being the next co host of Live. Are you talking about Fred Savage being the new co host of Live with Kelly? Then I think uh, that would be great lots of sex trolls. Um, you guys. <laughs> Some of the things they say, which is silly. The name of this movie right now is called Mommy I Didn't Do It. And yes, it is a, an all night shoot. We will probably shoot until the sun comes up. What brand of makeup do they use on me? They're asking. Lots of brands, like every brand. What's the most common brand <laughs> you use on me? No? Stella and Armani. Which one? Are the Armani and Stella? Armani Stila. and Stila. Stila eyeliner. That's this liquid pen eyeliner. The base. Uh, thank you, Jules, and for sharing. Um, we did shoot in a courtroom, but it wasn't a real courtroom. It was a set that looks like a courtroom. So Stila is the eyeliner and the Giorgio Armani um, foundation. My pleasure, Howard. So anyway, I'm going to wrap it up. I'm probably going to have a chance to do a Facebook Live, so you can join me over there if you want. But uh, thank you so much for joining me on the Danny Cam. You are the D Squad, and you are awesome. And I will see you again very soon. Oh, that was good. On the Danny Cam. Got it. Bye. Cut.